All right, now we're going to look at snapping. So what I want to do here is draw a line. And I'm going to draw a corner here. And over here I have my snapping menu. I'm going to turn all my snapping off. And then I'm going to go back and I'm going to try to draw uh, a, another line off of this line accurately. Well, in order to do that, I would have to zoom way in and go like this. And you can still see that it's a little offset. If you zoom way in here, it's offset. See it? So that's because I didn't have snapping on. Now, I don't usually show students right away what snapping is because they have to appreciate it. Uh, they have to design based upon no snapping in order to appreciate snapping. It's good to be uh, not reliant on the actual software itself doing the most of the work for you. All right, so in this case, I have snap nodes. Now, I'll turn the first one on and then these off. And the first one, if you see, it really doesn't do much of anything because this is just initiating all these others. So I'll turn this one on, for example. Snap the path allows me to, now you'll see a little X when I hover over the path. Now if I draw a line from here to here, the intersection between these two is perfect. Okay, now let's go to this one. This one I use the most. Of course, I keep most of these on to begin with, but... Okay, now hit escape to get out of that one. Now, if you look, I can now snap to the handle located here. Okay, and I'll hit escape, and you can see, perfect. All right, next one. Um, snap custom nodes including uh, rectangle corners. Okay, so this is a rectangle corner. So if you go like this, you'll notice that these act a little bit differently until you turn them into a piece of geometry or our slides using the path object to path command but having this feature on allows you to snap to the corner regardless of that and lastly this is the auto smooth node so um, it, other than having a line like that and choosing these to be auto smooth see now it says auto smooth handle so there we go okay so that's snapping in Inkscape um, all programs have snapping but it's in Illustrator, it has a lot of snapping occurring to everything. Uh, both work quite well, though. So, enjoy, and hope that helps.